chance to get better, you know, with a, with a game a week. So uh, we got to take advantage of this opportunity to, you know, take practice really serious and, and use, this, quickly to go. <laughs> use this December to get better. Emmanuel, about this time last year, we were kind of wondering, were you guys going to even have a quality win before Christmas? And then you go, you beat North Carolina, you beat Louisville. This was that time where you, like, jumped up. Did, did you... Is there anything you remember about what, where you made that progress last year? Um, I really think practice. You know, this time last year, is, it was really like, I guess, the, the Camp Cal where two of days start, classes are over. Uh, and all we're doing is going uh, in the morning, going in the evening, going out to dinner, and then restarting it every single day. So uh, we spend time with each other. We get, you know, real familiar with each other, and, and that's a chance for us to get better. Are you guys keeping an eye on those teams you're going to play out in? You know, at the end of the month here, Louisville and Ohio State, obviously, with a couple of big wins this week. Uh, yeah, we see we see the scores and we see the games a little bit, but right now we just kind of you know worry about one game at a time. Uh, just knowing that any team could beat you. You know, we got Fairly Dickinson coming up, and they're a really good team, so we got to be ready for them. Was that loss to Evansville a wake up call for a lot of guys that, especially the younger guys, who thought maybe we just roll in here and win? Uh, definitely. Uh, you know, coming from high school, you know, every game's not really that serious. Uh, so I guess you can kind of take that uh, up to the next level in college. But here in college, you know, anybody can beat you. And we've seen that uh, with a good team in Evansville. What do you know of Fairleigh Dickinson, if anything? Uh, don't know a lot. I'm sure we'll watch a little bit of a little bit of film and scout report today uh, and get a feel for them. How much do you guys watch? Because usually when we talk to you guys, all of you say, well, we haven't really seen it. How much do you watch it? How close to the game do you watch it? Uh, what you mean? Oh, the opponent. Um, we That's one of our big things, the scout report, you know, knowing who we're going against. Uh, for the guards, knowing if you got a shooter or a driver. For the bigs, knowing which hand they like to turn to to shoot jump hooks and stuff like that. Uh, so that's going to be a, a big key for us. You said you feel like you've become a much more vocal leader on the floor. How much have you seen that transpire just in the recent games you've had? Uh, I've seen it transpire a lot, you know. Um, this being my sophomore year, I learned a lot last year from guys like PJ, uh, Reed, and older guys like that, you know, just showing me, you know, what it takes to be a leader. Um, and I'm just trying to take that into this year uh, and, and, and help us get wins. Do you guys pay much attention to what's going on just in college basketball in general? There's been a lot of crazy games. And we're only the first week of December. Yeah, uh, I definitely individually. Yeah, I definitely take. A, I'm just a, a basketball fan. So whether it's like college, NBA, I'm always watching basketball. You know, that's just something I, I love to watch. So uh, yeah, especially even the teams that we got. Uh, you know, coming up. You know, you just you see uh, everybody's doing pretty good. So you know, we got to be in our P's and Q's and be ready to play. What's Cal been preaching the last week? He usually has some kind of message he wants to. Get across to you guys. Uh, two words been fight and finish. Uh, these next games coming up, you know, we, we're playing some pretty tough teams and we're gonna have to fight a little bit harder. Uh, and then finishing games, the last five, four minutes of the games, you know, he's been preaching that we gotta, you know, stay locked in, stay focused.